Hi guys. Um, so I wanted to go over number bonds. I know that when we were growing up, we didn't have number bonds, but a lot of what we did have was the fact families. So if we had six at the top, we had the different numbers that would make up six. Essentially, that's what a um, <clears throat> number bond is. You have the whole at the top. So the whole would be six and the two parts would be five and one or three and three, two and four. So it makes up the whole of six. So whenever your child is talking about a number bond, just know that the total is at the top and then you can add these two parts together to get the total. So for tonight's homework, you'll notice that there are number bonds and it says to write a number bond on the front. So for instance, if six is the whole, which it is, the two parts, I'm sorry, this is mirrored, so I can't really see what I'm doing. So if six is the whole, then the two parts could be three plus three. And then on the back, they would write the number sentence three plus three. Another way to do it would be six is the whole and two and four. So the number sentence on the back would be two plus four equals six. All right, let me know if you have any other questions and I'll be glad to help you out. All right, have a good evening.